I think it's raining. Oh my god, everything is gonna be wet. <laughs> Morning, my friends. I am here in uh, Lantenay, in uh, near Dijon. So I am here in near Dijon. And uh, today I'm starting my last, today is my last stage in, uh, in France. So I'm gonna go from Dijon to Pontarlier before crossing into, you can see the border here, before crossing from Pontarlier to Switzerland. Last stage in France. L'Antenay. So actually I stayed several days in L'Antenay. I was, uh, it was, it was great. I was uh, welcomed, I was hosted by, um, the parents of uh, a very good friend from my studies and from, uh, from the time uh, when I was working in Paris. So I had a good rest, stayed uh, four days here in, in this village. Yeah, so it's about 150 kilometers to Pontarlier, so it should take me probably two days. I'll try to do a big stage on the first day. In, in addition to being the, the, um, the last, my last stage in France, it's gonna be my first mountain range because Pontarlier is in the Jura, which is a, a mountain range that you have in Northern Switzerland and then also in this part of France, in Eastern France, Eastern Central France. Anyway, let's go to Pontarlier. As I am close to Dijon, I have to go through the city. So to make it easier, there is a, a cycle path along the, the canal of Burgundy. And uh, I'm just gonna follow it through Dijon. It's gonna be easy, nice. I've got a new cushion for my, for my bottom. So now I have, that's very important. That's the most important. I've got one cushion for my head for when I camp and one cushion for my seat. Ah, what a luxury. You see the bird, nice. I guess they are doing the, the maintenance of the canal, digging the, digging the bottom to maintain its depth. Jean. That looks like a, a Jean. Bonjour. Euh, Aujourd'hui, je suis parti de Lantenay, mais j'ai commencé à, à Soissons, près de Reims. D'accord. Et je vais vers les Balkans. Vous, vous allez où Alors nous, on va jusqu'à saint jean de jaune le, le canal de Nivernais. Ok. Mais hier, on n'a pas roulé parce que... Ah bah hier, c'était une catastrophe, ouais. C'était la cata. Alors on a, on a été vite, c'était beau. Ah oui, d'accord. C'est sympa, bonne, non ouais. Ah oui, d'accord. Ouais. Bonjour. Bon. Super. Super. En croisant les doigts pour prendre le pas d'eau. Ben ouais, ouais. 
Bonne route. Bonne route à vous aussi, ouais. It's funny, this guy uh, just came next to me and started chatting. I'm so fast, I'm overtaking the boat. <laughs> Guys, look at that. I don't know if you can see, but that's the total distance I put in the bike. And it's 996. That's it. 1,000 kilometers. <laughs> 1,000. Look at that. Do you see behind me? There is a boulangerie. <laughs> Perfect for my lunch. And you know what? The boulangerie just closed. <laughs> well, bad luck. Yeah, so I'm done with my lunch. I did not film it because uh, the boulangerie was closed, closed just when I arrived. Yes, yeah, so I had nothing special. I mean, I had dry sausage. I had the usual cheese and, and dry sausage and bread and a, and a salad in a box. And we are in the city of Dol. Wow, beautiful town. That's beautiful, isn't it? It's raining on and off now. I found a small opportunity to film. I passed Dol and I'm going through a beautiful forest now, very beautiful. I think it's raining. So you are inside, I don't know, well not completely, oh no, you are inside my rain jacket and it's raining. I was not expecting rain for today, it is raining. It came, it's funny because it came very suddenly when I was, when I was talking to you in, uh, just before, I, I looked in front on the road and it was like all white and I could, I could, I was 100% sure it was like heavy rain coming soon. So I stopped as soon as I could <laughs> and like uh, find my, find my rain jacket and protect myself for the shower. Whew. And the sun is back again. And here we go again on the way to the Jura Mountains after the big shower. <laughs> my ass is all wet. Because my seat is all wet. And the road is still steaming. Let's enjoy the nice ride in a beautiful forest. I don't know if you can see the, you know, the after the rain, the sky. The air is always is so clean, so the, the visibility is, is fantastic. I love it. I don't know if you can see the difference from uh, when I feel now compared to before. And another car coming through the mist.
It's an endless forest. I'm almost done for today. And already, wow, already 99.6 kilometers today. So I guess it's gonna be a new record. And in the distance, in front, you don't, uh, even if I show you, you can't see, I guess. But uh, yeah, in the distance, I can already see the first slopes of the Jura, Jura mountain. So I'm just outside. Oh, it's it's beautiful, huh? <laughs> but the the main thing is like I'm just outside the, the camping where I'm I'm staying tonight, and and you probably don't know, but in uh, in eastern France, northeastern France, it has been raining a lot during the last week, and uh, basically behind the camping there is a river a small river and look how is the river now you know those trees you see this tree has nothing to see i mean this tree is supposed to be outside of the river oh my god so all all the water you see here is is because the the river is uh, is it's it's a field that is flooded actually all the water here is uh, it's not supposed to be a river, it's supposed to be a field. So I hope the <laughs> today is night. I hope the, the river doesn't go up more and uh, and flood. I hope it doesn't flood the the camping. Oh my god. And now wow holy shit. I've never seen anything like that. Look at this guy. I don't know if you're gonna see something, but this is gonna be a tutorial, a very, very important tutorial. It's like entering a tent when you are soaked. <laughs> oh my god, my feet are completely wet. to arrange everything is it's gonna be <laughs> a disaster <laughs> oh my god everything is gonna be wet <laughs> mm.